Sir Elton John became emotional after the world premiere of a documentary looking back on his life, stressing to the audience the importance of family over fame. The singer, 77, appeared at the Toronto International Film Festival, marking his first public appearance since a severe eye infection had left him with limited vision in one eye. Directed by R.J. Cutler and Sir Elton's husband, David Furnish, the documentary titled Elton John, Never Too Late, looks back over the musician's decades-long career and captures him preparing for his final concert in North America, at Dodger Stadium in Los Angeles. It also documents his love story with Canadian filmmaker Furnish, who married Sir Elton in 2014. They share two sons, Zachary and Elijah. After the film was screened, Sir Elton became overwhelmed with emotion, telling the audience, the thing I love about this movie is that I have him, Furnish, and I have my two sons. I'm very proud of what I've achieved, he said, pausing to hold back his tears. And I will hope to keep making music, but I want to be at home with them and see them and treasure them. It's the greatest feeling I've ever had in my life, more than having a first number one album on Billboard, yeah, that was really nice for about five minutes, but this is a lifetime. The singer also reportedly made a joke about his eye, telling the audience, I'm having the best time of my life, except this f asterisk 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 i i wish i could see you according to variety his appearance comes days after making a health announcement on instagram to his almost 5 million fans over the summer i've been dealing with a severe eye infection that has unfortunately left me with only limited vision in one eye sir elton wrote i am healing but it's an extremely slow process and it will take some time before sight returns to the impacted eye I am so grateful for the excellent team of doctors and nurses and my family, who have taken such good care of me over the last several weeks. I have been quietly spending the summer recuperating at home, and am feeling positive about the progress I have made in my healing and recovery thus far. Despite the announcement, the Rocketman star appeared in good spirits as he arrived on the back of a buggy at the Canadian Festival, alongside his husband Furnish, both wearing different shades of burgundy suits. The singer, who was made a member of the Order of the Companions of Honor at a ceremony in November 2021, is known for hits including I'm Still Standing and Your Song. In 2019 he was played by Kingsman actor Taron Egerton in a musical film about his life called Rocketman. The Toronto Film Festival also saw stars including Florence Pugh and Andrew Garfield at the premiere of We Live in Time, while Tom Hiddleston, Karen Gillan and Chiwetel Ejiofor were promoting their new sci-fi film The Life of Chuck.